Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawak. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds filled with grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You give them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you give us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, and that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour, Pour forth, forth, we beseech, beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, May by, by his passion, passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, to the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the joyful mysteries, the first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day all daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery, the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day all daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen.
the fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not, not our petitions, nor our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, God whose only, only begotten, begotten Son, Son, by His life, death, and, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, life. grant we beseech you that meditating, meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of Saint Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve the Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee Prayer O God, our Father, and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate, 
O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa. Today is Monday in the eighth week of ordinary time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock, his shepherds. Come, let, let us sing joyful songs, songs to the Lord. Lord. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn, as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massah they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, there are people whose hearts go stray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Please be seated. It's morning, Lord. You fill us with your kindness. O Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to the next. Before the mountains were born, or the earth or the world brought forth, you are God without beginning or end. You turn men back to dust and say, Go back, sons of men. To your eyes a thousand years, I like yesterday, come and gone, no more than a watch in the night. You sweep men away like a dream, like grass which springs up in the morning, in the morning it springs up and flowers, by evening it withers and fades. So we are destroyed in your anger, struck with terror in your fury. 
Our guilt lies open before you, our secrets in the light of your face. All our days pass away in your anger, our life is over like a say, our span is seventy years, or eighty for those who are strong. And most of these are emptiness and pain, they pass swiftly and we are gone, who understand the power of your anger and feel the strength of your fury. Make us know the shortness of our life, that we may gain wisdom of heart. Lord, relent is your anger forever. Show pity to your servants. In the morning, fill us with your love. We shall exult and rejoice all our days. Give us joy to balance our affliction for the years when we knew misfortune. Show forth your work to your servants. Let your glory shine on their children. Let the favor of the Lord be upon us. Give success to the work of our hands. Give success to the work of our hands. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. From the farthest bounds of earth, may God be praised. Sing to the Lord a new song. His praise from the end of the earth. Let the sea and what fills it resound, the coastlands and those who dwell in them. Let the steppe and its cities cry out, the villages where Kedar dwells. Let the inhabitants of Selah exult and shout from the top of the mountains. Let them give glory to the Lord and utter his praise in the coastlands. The Lord goes forth like a hero, like a warrior, he stirs his order. He shouts out his battle cry. Against his enemies, he shows his might. I have looked away and kept silence. I have not nothing holding myself in. But now I cry out as a woman in labor, gasping and panting. I will lay waste mountains and hills. All their herbets I will dry up. I will turn the rivers into marshes, and the marshes I will dry up. I will let the blind on their journey. By paths unknown I will guide them. I will turn darkness into light before him, and make crooked ways straight. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. You who stand in his sanctuary, praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise him, servants of the Lord. In the courts, stand in the courts of the house of our God. Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing psalms to his name, for he is loving. For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself, and Israel for his own possession. For I know the Lord is great, that our Lord is high above all gods. The Lord does whatever he wills, in heaven, on earth, in the seas. He summons clouds from the ends of the earth, makes lightning produce the rain. From his treasuries he sends forth the wind. The firstborn of the Egyptians he smote, of men and beasts alike, signs and wonders he worked in the midst of your land of Egypt, against Pharaoh and all his servants. Nations in their greatness he struck, and kings in their splendor he slew, Sihon, king of the Amorites, Og, the king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan. He let Israel inherit their land. On his people their land he bestowed. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. Grant us, O Lord, we pray, that the course of our world may be directed by your peaceful rule, and that your church may rejoice untroubled in her devotion, to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen.
Please be seated. A reading from the first letter of St. Peter. Blessed be God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who in his great mercy gave us a new birth to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead to an inheritance of an imperishable, undefiled, and unfading kept in heaven for you who by the power of God are safeguarded through faith to a salvation that is ready to be revealed in the final time. In this, you rejoice, although now for a little while you may have to suffer various kinds of trials, so that the genuineness of your faith, more precious than gold that is perishable, even though tested by fire, may prove to be for praise, glory, and honor at the revelation of Jesus Christ. Although you have not seen him yet, you love him. Even though you do not see him now, yet you believe him. You rejoice in an indescribable and glorious joy as you attain the goal of faith, the salvation of your souls. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord will remember his covenant forever. The Lord will remember his covenant forever. I will give thanks to the Lord with all my heart in the company and assembly of the just. Great are the works of the Lord, exquisite in all their delights. The Lord will remember his covenant forever. He has given food to those who fear him. He will be forever mindful of his covenant. He has made known to his people the power of his works, giving them the inheritance of the nations. The Lord will remember his covenant forever. He has sent deliverance to his people. He has ratified his covenant forever. Holy and awesome as he is, his praise endures forever. The Lord will remember his covenant forever. Please stand. Christ became poor although he was rich so that by his poverty you might become rich. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. As Jesus was sitting out on a journey, a man ran up, knelt down before him and asked him, Good teacher, what must I do to inherit eternal life? Jesus answered him, Why do you call me good? No one is good but God alone. You know the commandments, you shall not kill, you shall not commit adultery, you shall not steal, you shall not bear false witness, you shall not defraud, honor your father and your mother. He replied and said to him, 
Teacher, all of this I have observed from my youth. Jesus, looking at him, loved him and said to him, You are lacking in one thing. Go, sell what you have, and give to the poor, and you will have treasure in heaven. Then come, follow me. At that statement, his face fell, and he went away sad, for he had many possessions. Jesus looked around him and said to his disciples, How hard it is for those who have wealth to enter the kingdom of God. The disciples were amazed at his words, so Jesus again said to them in reply, Children, how hard it is to enter the kingdom of God. It is easier for a camel to pass through the eye of a needle than for one who is rich to enter the kingdom of God. They were exceedingly astonished and said among themselves, Then who can be saved? Jesus looked at them and said, For men it is impossible, but not for God. All things are possible for God. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Sa pangkaraniwang kaisipan ng lahat ng tao, ang Diyos ay ubod ng makapangyarihan. Kaya aminin man o hindi, maraming mga tao na pagkakamalan, ang kwarta ay Diyos. Bakit? Sapagat napaka makapangyarihan. Dito sa mundong ito, lahat ng bagay na bibili. Gusto nyo ng mabilis na edukasyon, mag magpagawa lang kayo ng diploma sa klaro emrecto. Kahit sa ang universidad ninyo gustong graduate, ipapagawa kayo kahit sa Harvard or Oxford. May pera lang kayo. Kung kayo nagkaroon ng kaso, madaling maabsuelto. Kumuha ng mahusay na abogado. Kahit na kayo ang salarin, mapapalaya kayo sa teknikalidad. Kung may pera kayo, maski sa larangan ng romansa, gusto niyong mapaibig ang isang dilaga, isang binata. Magbigay kayo ng malalaking regalo. Pakita niyo kayo ay may money. Sapagkat kapag ka may money, may honey. Baka pakasalan ka nga kahit wala kang itsura. At kung hindi ka man pakasalan, baka pumayag na mag-live-in kasama mo. Ganyan kapangyarihan ng pag-ibig, ano? Maski nga sa kapangyarihan, pwede mong bilin kung gusto mong mapwesto sa gobyerno. Kung dadaanin sa halalan, mabibili mo yung mga bumaboto. At hindi mo lang mabibili yung mga bumaboto, pati yung mga nagbibilang ng boto. Paano hindi mabibili ng pera? Kaya lahat tayo, ang patakaran dito sa mundo, pera, pera, pera. Lahat ng ating katanungan tungkol sa pera. Hoy, makidamay tayo doon sa namatayan. O anong tanong? Mapukukwartahan ba yan? Meron ba sugalan habang namboburol? Diyos ko, pati pa ba naman yung burulan? Gagawing kasino? O, oh, ayan, kwarta yun. Di ba? O, oh, ayan, may nasalanta ng bagyo. May naghihirap ng taghihikahos at kailangan ng ayuda sa pandemya, COVID-19. O yung ibang iniisip agad, mapagkukwartahan ba yan? May racket sa charity, ano? Lahat ang gumagalaw, pera. 
Kaya aminin man o hindi, maraming mga tao ang sinasamba kwarta. Yun ang kinang minamahal. Minamahal nila yung pera. Pera, pera, pera. Kaya nga napakahirap nilang pumasok sa langit. O eto, kaya eto ngayon, ano, ang babala ng ating Panginoong Yeso Kristo, nakakagitla, ano, nakakagulat. It's easier for a camel to enter into the hole of a needle than for a rich man to enter the kingdom of God. Ayan mo yung camel, yung laki-laki. At yung butas ng karayo, man liit-liit. Kaya tingnan mo yung paghahambing ng Panginoon kung gaano kahirap dun sa mayaman ang pumasok sa paghahari ng Diyos. Yung kamilyo, papasok dun sa butas ng karayom. Ganon kahirap ang pagpasok ng mayaman sa paghahari ng Diyos. Yung napakalaking hayo, papasok sa napakaliit na butas. Kaya kung kayo mayaman, nakikinig kayo sa Panginoon Heso Kristo, eh mga ngatog ang mga tuhod ninyo. Eh bakit ba nagkaganon? Kung yung mayaman, kung, kung yung mayaman, ang minahal lang niya sa buhay ay kwarta, kwarta, kwarta. Sapagkat kung ano minamahal mo, nagiging kamukha ka ng minamahal mo. Kaya yung mga taong walang minahal dito sa lupang ito, kundi pera, nagmumukhang pera, di ba? Kaya sinasabi nyo, naku, yung taong yan, ano, hindi mo magugulangan, hindi mo mahihingan. Naku, iniimbak ang pera sa kanyang bahay at sa kanyang bangko. Bakit? Eh, mukhang pera yan eh. Mukhang pera. Kung ano minamahal nyo, nagiging kamukha kayo ng minamahal nyo. Kaya mag-iingat kayo sa mga minamahal nyo, nagiging kamukha kayo niyan. Magmahal kayo sa pera, magmamukha kayong kwarta. Kaya ang Diyos inutos, mahalin siya. Yung bang pagmamahal na iuutos? Kung magkakaroon tayo ng bagong presidente, pwede ba niyang sabihin, oh, lahat ng mga Pilipino, ang unang batas na ipapasa ay mahalin ako para tayo magkaisa. Pag hindi niyo ako minahal, pakukulong ko kayo. Pwede ba niyang gawin yun? Yung maha- pagmamahal ba, iniuutos? O bakit inutos ng Panginoon? Para ba sa kanyang sarili yun? Hindi, para sa atin. Bakit? Sapagkat kung anong minamahal mo, kung sino minamahal mo, nagiging kamukha ka ng minamahal mo. Kung nagmamahal ka sa pera, nagmumukha kang kwarta. Kung minamahal mo ang Diyos, nagmumukha kang Diyos. At pagkamukha ka ng Diyos, anak ka ng Diyos. Siya ang iyong ama. Sapagkat ang mga ama ang inaasahan yung anak nila, kamukha nila. O yung mga tatay dito, di ba, paglabas ng anak nyo, ang una nyo tinitingnan, sino kamukha? Sapagkat yung nanay, sigurado niya, anak niya yon. Pero yung tatay, oh... Kaya ang Diyos ang inaasahan, ang papasok sa langit niya, ay eh mga anak niya, sapagkat ang mga anak ang pinamamanahan. Yun ang pinatitira ng walang hanggan sa iyong tahanan, yung mga estranghero. Ha? Hindi mo pinatitira sa bahay mo, yung mga anak mo. Yun ang pinamamanahan mo. Kaya titingnan kayo kung kamukha niya. Ato kayo sa langit, patitingnan. O kamukha ko ba yan? E paano ko yung magiging kamukha ng Diyos? Paano ako magiging kamukha ng Diyos? Kung inibig ko ang Diyos, eh kung sa buhay na ito wala akong ginawa, kundi kwarta, kwarta, kwarta. E di mukha akong kwarta. Pagtingin ng Diyos sa akin, Hoy! Mukhang kwarta! E ano ba yung kwarta? Sa ang bagaling yan? Madumi yan! Yan ang kuharta, madumi. E ba't mo dudumihan yung kabusi-busilak na langit? 
Daladala mo yung kwarta. Aanin mo yan dito. Sabihin ng Panginoon. Aanin ko yung mga tao mukhang kwarta. Dumi lang yan. Ngayon, may gamit ang dumi dito sa mundo. Kaya nga ang kwarta hindi minamahal. Ginagamit. Ano gamit ng dumi dito sa mundo? Pataba, fertilizer. Tingnan nyo lahat ng fertilizer, yung mga organic fertilizer, galing sa dumi. Dumi ng hayo, dumi ng halaman, pero nagpapataba ng lupa. Sapagkat ang pera para sa lupa pinatataba. Para nang sa ganun, magkaroon tayo ng hanap buhay, makatulong sa mga nagugutom at nauuhaw, magbigay ng ayuda sa mga naghihikahos, pantulong, ginagamit. Hindi yan minamahal. Ginagamit yan. Paano ang paggamit? Pataba, dumi. E kayo ba gusto nyo laging may dumi yung kamay nyo? Di ba? Ang gusto nyo pagkatapos nyo patabain yung lupa, eh, eh lilinisin nyo na yung kamay nyo. Ganun ang pagtrato sa pera, kaya ang pera hindi masama. Ang sabi ni San Pablo tungkol sa pera ay hindi... Money is the root of all evil. Hindi yan ang sinabi, ha? May mga tao, gano'n ang sinasabi sa akin. Sabi, pinutol mo ka ako yung sinabi ni San Pablo. Ang sinabi ni San Pablo sa unang liham sa tabanga taga sa, sa, kay Timoteo, ang unang niya sinabi, ang sinabi niya, ang pag-ibig sa pera, ang ugat ng lahat ng kasalanan. Yung pag-ibig, bakit may isisisi sa pera? Yung mga taong nagmamahal sa pera, bakit? Eh, nagmamukhang pere. Kaya tumingin kayo sa salamin, ha? Ititingin ako sa salamin, mukha ba akong pera? Ay, napakahirap para sa akin na pumasok sa paghahari ng Diyos. Mas madali pa raw yung kamelyo na pumasok sa butas ng karayong kesa sa mga taong mukhang pera. ay eh kung mahal ko ang Diyos. Di kakamukha ko ang Diyos. Di pagkatok ko doon sa langit, ngingiti sa akin ng Diyos, ah, ito, sigurado ko, anak ko. Bakit? Kamukha ko. Mahal ako. Inibig akong todo-todo nito. Sa kanyo ko ipamamana ang kaharian ko. Ano pipiliin niyo? Diyos o pera? Oh, we all stand to offer our prayers. For every intention, we're going to say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the Church may continually show concern and support for the neglected and the downtrodden of our society. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That those who call themselves disciples of Christ may realize that what really matters in life is concern for others who are less fortunate than themselves. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That we may find the wisdom of seeking first the kingdom of God and of spending our lives in its service. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That the sick may be consoled and strengthened by Christ. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those whom we promise to pray, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For the Master of the Order and His assistants, and for our brothers and sisters at Santo Domingo, and Our Lady of the Rosary, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. 
for the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions. We pray, Lord, hear our prayer, that our deceased relatives and friends may enjoy the victory of Christ in the kingdom of heaven. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Almighty Father, give us the generosity of heart to love you with all our might and to make use of all the blessings that you have given us to love those whom you love. We ask you this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. This will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this wine to offer. Through the divine works of human hands, this will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept this sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Trusting in your compassion, O Lord, we come eagerly with our offerings to your sacred altar, that through the purifying action of your grace we may be cleansed by the very mysteries we serve. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Let Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Father most holy, through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, you were through whom you made all things, whom you sent as our Savior and Redeemer, incarnate by the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin fulfilling your will and gaining for you a holy people. He stretched out his hands as he endured his passion to us to break the bonds of death and manifest the resurrection. And so with angels and all the saints, we declare your glory as with one voice we acclaim.
Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, he broke it. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francisco, our Pope, Socrates, our Bishop, Fidelis, our Auxiliary Bishop, Gerard, the Master of the Order of Preachers and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph, her beloved spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, Saint Dominic and Saint Francis, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Please all stand. Jesus loves us, and in his love for us, he taught us to call his own Father, our Father, so we have the courage to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. From the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. 
who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold, this is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this communion. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Please kneel. Let us pray that the forecoming election may truly reflect the will of the Lord who guides the destinies of nations. Let us pray together, deliver us, Lord. Deliver us, Lord. Deliver us, Lord, from coercion, violence, and terrorism. Deliver, deliver us, us, Lord. From dishonesty, lies, and all distortion of truth. Deliver us, Lord. From bribery, graft, and all conspiracy for fraud. Deliver us, Lord. From threats, intimidation, and perverse language. Deliver us, Lord. Let us pray together, hear us, Lord. Hear us, Lord. That conscience may always be our ultimate norm. Hear us, Lord. That the common good may always be our highest goal. Hear us, Lord. That human dignity may be respected all the time. Hear us, Lord. That the poor and the weak may always have the priority. Hear us, Lord. That genuine fear of God and love of neighbors may guide those who seek public office. Hear us, Lord. Let us pray. Shepherd of souls and savior of the nations, politics is your gift to us, a call to serve others. May our political engagement for voters and candidates bring glory to your loving name and help us grow in holiness forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Please all stand.
Blessed be the Lord, for he has come to his people and set them free. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Blessed be the Lord, for he has come to his people and set them free. Let us pray. Nourished by your saving gifts, we beseech your mercy, Lord, that by this same sacrament with which you feed us in the present age, you may make us partakers of life eternal through Christ our Lord. Amen. Kami po ito uspuso nagpapasalamat sa lahat sa inyong nakiisa sa amin sa pagdiriwang ng Santa Eucharistia. Naway pagpatuloy niyo po ang pagdarasal para sa mga naglilingkod sa inyo dito sa Basilica Minore of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag. Makakaasa kayong kami rin magpapatuloy ng aming pagdarasal para sa inyo at sa inyong mga minamahal sa buhay. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass ascended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. Now please join as we pray for the blessing of the sick and then followed by the prayer for the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness towards our sick and aging brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness. Restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.